review of Winter Gardens, Margate by Sarah Millican. Delightful filth. It's obvious that Sarah Millican is happy to be back on stage, and judging by the enthusiastic applause she receives at the Winter Gardens in Margate, her admirers are too, similar to her other performances. Bobby Dazzler is a crowd pleaser that embraces her unapologetic candor on women's bodies in scatological filth. Knitting and yoga are two of the sought after quiet pastimes that are discussed with the audience throughout the first part of the event. Although there's always a chance that some people won't speak up or that everyone did the same thing, Margate's Millican was able to include some good peritin stuff into this section of the program that seemed to be spontaneous. It did, however, seem a bit long, and many people in the crowd seemed to be losing interest in it. But in the second part of the novel, Millican is at her most animated, describing her own lockup and the events of the previous two years. At 46, though, her body seems to be failing her. This isn't her whining about life's ups and downs, though, as recent events have shown us, many do not get the opportunity to live long lives, so she views being able to age as a privilege. However, just when you think she's going sentimental, she transforms this insight into a hilarious series of jokes about Madonna being trapped in an eternal state of youth. A lot of ground is covered by Millikan, including the benefits of wearing a nightie because she gets a chinful of tits when she lies in bed, the meaning behind the twee slogans on women's clothing, sanitary products, smear tests, piles and diarrhea, and much more. She does this with some eye-watering detail and a knowing look to the audience when she pushes things towards the uneasiness.